Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. This is your girl, Creole Shawty Tarot. If you're new, welcome. Welcome back to anybody that, you know, has been here for a while. So let's go ahead and get into it. Holy Spirit. messages that you have for my Pisces. First out, Queen of Wands. ones all right somebody is trying to oppress you because of your confidence you full of fire right now uh you could be going towards your goals and things like that there's somebody that could be trying to block that or stop that um this person could be a Sagittarius you could have strong Sagittarius in your chart take it how it resonates but I feel like this person is wanting you in the seven of Pentacles energy where it's like uh, your dreams are being deferred or put on hold. Like I said, this don't have to be what's happening, but this is what somebody is wanting for you. They wanting you oppressed. Because I feel like it's something about how passionate you are behind something. All right. The fire is burning within you so therefore it's like uh you charging towards things in a very passionate way this person could be running out of options with the last judgment in the reverse they could be trying to figure out how can they come forward with some type of a attack to make you feel rejected with the four of cups for my male pisces this could be a fire sign woman that you could be dealing with um, that you have not made a decision about or this person may have not made a decision about you. We have the chariot here. So it looks like somebody here is moving forward. All right, and then we have the seven of wands. So in regards to the person that could be trying to stop you or block your shine here, I, I still see that there is forward movement here. All right, I feel like you're fighting for what you have worked hard for. You could have Leo in your Mars placement. Yeah, we have the Ten of Cups here, the Four of Pentacles, and we also have Justice. All right, so you could also be protecting yourself at this time, protecting your assets, your finances. All right. But uh, whatever it is that you're doing, keep doing it because it looks like uh, you're doing good work here. And like I said, keep certain things to yourself. Be selective on who it is that you share your business with. But I'm definitely seeing justice being served, balance being brought into a situation. All right. You could be waiting as well to get back information in regards to a legal situation. Concerning some type of conflict that you had or an exchange that you had with someone. This could also be you getting something trademarked, copyrighted, branded. With that four of pentacles and a justice with this ten of cups. Yeah, like I encourage people all the time, get you an intellectual property lawyer here. We have temperance. All right, so there go to the balance once again. Yeah, I feel like for some of you all, something here could have affected something that you was working on, but it's like balance is going to be brought into a situation. Something will find, like this issue will find a resolution. Capricorn, Scorpio energy could be significant. All right, but we have three cards here that Sagittarius energy. So heavy on the Sagittarius, we also have Gemini energy coming out with the lovers. Like I said, I feel like um, it's something concerning, something that you're real good at, you're very passionate about. 
uh, you're on fire right now. And I feel like somebody is definitely trying to oppress you, trying to affect your confidence. But like I said, you still having this forward movement. All right. Leaving certain things behind, walking away from something, letting something be. Yeah. Six of swords, nine of pentacles. It's like you don't have time to be focusing on something that is not paying you. It's kind of like that energy where it's like a mind a business that pays you, right? Somebody is not doing that. But you are. And this is why you're having this forward movement and this material gain. Yeah. You're taking your power back with the three of wands. Yeah. Wheel of Fortune. And it's landing you to some fortune here. All right. So, yeah. It's like uh, what doesn't kill you make you stronger, right? So, you could also be revisiting something from the past. Something that you put to the side. Something that could be a childhood dream of yours is what I'm also getting with the Six of Cups at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, we have the Nine of Swords here. So somebody could be stressed out or worried about something here. Why is this Nine of Swords here? Two of Wands, yeah, because you're taking control. Whatever this, this person thought that they was controlling, they're not controlling a thing. You still getting this Ace of Cups. Yep. And it's because you put in the work for it with the eight of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. We have the seven of swords, but you still got this person that's trying to sneak you uh, do something deceptive or sneaky behind your back, creating illusions with the seven of cups. Seventy seven could be significant. All right. But I feel like this cup is divinely given. All right. Some of you all could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, masculine energy right behind that. We have the um, king of pentacles. So it could also be an earth sign, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. So, yeah, let me pull your overall advice. Holy Spirit, what is the overall advice for Pisces? What is the overall advice for Pisces? I choose the joy of God instead of pain. No one created by God can find joy in anything except the eternal, not because he is deprived of anything else, but because nothing else is worthy of him. So yeah, choose what you focus on. Because like I said, somebody is wanting you to focus on the wrong things because they're trying to distract you from whatever your purpose or your promise is. And what it's saying is it's not even worth putting your time and attention into that. Focus on the future. All right. What you're trying to create, where you're headed, where you're going. Keep that tunnel vision. Love created me like itself. You are the work of God and his work is wholly lovable and wholly loving. This is how a man must think of himself in his heart because this is what he is. So yeah, it's all in, you know, what you feel and think about yourself. Do not allow other people you know, to make you feel a certain type of way. And I don't really feel like that's what you're doing. Like I said at the beginning of the reading, you're very confident and it's triggering somebody because of your confidence and because you keep on going and moving forward when they're thinking that they're stopping or blocking you. But that's what I have for you, Pisces. And until next time, bye.